Good morning, Wildcats. Today's Thursday, April 11th, and you're watching Keeping, Keeping Up, Up with, with the Cats. Cats. They've done it again. 13 of our high school chorus students represented McKeel at the FEA Central Florida State Solo and Ensemble Festival at First Presbyterian Church of Lakeland. We had one large ensemble performance and two solo performances. All entries received the highest rating of superior. This is another great accomplishment from our students and a testament of their very hard work and dedication. Please congratulate them when you see them. Trouts for the McKeel cheer team will be held April 16th through the 19th. Packets are available in the front office or in the media center. Packets must be completed and a current physical must be on file to participate in tryouts. If you have any questions, see Ms. Gilliam in the media center. If you'd like to try out for the McKeel Dazzlers dance team, tryouts will be held the week of April 22nd from 3.30 to 5.30 in the gymnasium. You must have an updated sports physical on file before trouts. If you are interested, applications are located in the main office. Please contact Ms. Robinson for more information. Hey Wildcats, I'm Trinity and I'm Abby and, and welcome back, back to, to top, top 5. This week's topic is Top 5 Senior Assassin Eliminations. Here's Andrea and Skylar with this week's finalists. Wildcats. I'm Angie and I'm Skylar and, and we're your hosts for this week. Here are this week's finalists. At number five we have McKinley Gunter getting Easton Benton out while he was enjoying his meal. At number four we have Kendall Orm getting the first elimination of the game by surprising Juliet practice. <laughs> At number three, we have Malayla Miller pulling a sneak attack on Olivia Pila the moment she made the mistake of removing her goggles. I don't think you are either. She, I, like I said, she's like... <gasps> In number two, we have Carson Richardson getting the last elimination of the game, Rio Tillman. <gasps> yes! At number one, we have Rio Tillman who got seven people out with one of her best eliminations of the game, Kayla McBride. Yes! Yes! Thanks for joining us. And see you next time on, on Top 5. Hey Wildcats, this week on Senior Spotlight, I'm here with Olivia Pila. Olivia recently committed to New College of Florida for softball. Olivia, what made you decide that school and what are you most excited for? Um, I'm definitely most excited to be able to play on the beach and I definitely chose that school because as soon as I stepped on campus, I felt at home and I love the team, they're super cool. Amazing, and what has been your favorite part of high school? Definitely winning districts last year. I felt very special being a part of something to represent our school. Perfect, and what advice do you have for the underclassmen? Um, Definitely make new friends, be kind to everyone. Perfect, thank you for joining me. Of course. For this week's Teacher Spotlight, I'm here with Miss Kendrick. Tell me a little bit about yourself. Well, just a little bit about myself. I have been teaching here at McKill for three years. I've been teaching my subject for five years, and I truly enjoy teaching history, civics, and uh, intro to social science. What made you choose to teach this subject? Um, I actually really love history. I like to dive into things, um, especially learning about how our country come, came about um, and how things are created and how our founding fathers actually built on this country. So, it's fun. Super nice. Thank you. Hey guys, what did y'all talk about this week on Ask the Cats? Let's, Let's go, go check it out. Let's go, girls. What's up, Wildcats? And welcome back to Ask the Cats. <laughs> this week, we asked the students what they like to do in their free time. Let's go check it out. In my free time, I like to take naps. In my free time, I like to listen to music. In my free time, I like to eat food. In my free time, I don't have free time. In my free time, I like to go to the beach. In my free time, I like to sleep. In my free time, I usually just watch TV or FaceTime my friends. In my free time, I usually like to go to the beach and hang out with my friends. <laughs> Last time. Last time on Wildcat Watch.
Hello, boys. Oh, crap. Hello? Where am I? Hello? Well, 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 look who we have here. What's going on? Who snitched on us, Chris? Nobody. Are you sure? Well, I guess we're gonna do the hard way. Get his belt! <laughs> Chris, Chris, Chris. We've been at this for hours. Just tell us who it is. Nobody. Tell us, Chris! It is I need your help. I need your help. <laughs> Meet at the Wildcat right now. I'm already here, where are you guys at? Look what they're doing to Officer Chris. If you want Officer Chris back, I need a level reduction. And 40 positives. Each. No. We need to save them, but who's gonna be our leader? I'm the leader! What are you doing? Two, one. Two, one. Two, one. Chris, are you okay? Chris, are you okay? Hands, go, go, go. But I had that in the bag, man. What y'all doing? I had him right where I wanted them. You good, Chris? You good? I'm good. I'm good. Wait, where's Aiden? Aiden's right there. Stop right there. So y'all really thought y'all could steal a car and kidnap him? Don't be mad at me. Be mad at him. What were y'all thinking? Softball lost to GJ and Fort Meade. They play Friday night against Sebring at 7. The baseball team is in the county tournament. They beat GJ on Monday, Winter Haven on Tuesday, and they play for the county championship tonight at 7 at Lake Myrtle against LCS. Good luck! signings in the past week from softball, baseball, and soccer. Skylar Smith to Pasco Hernando for softball. Olivia Pila to New College of Florida for softball. Nate Miller to Longwood University for soccer. Braxton Plemings to Bethany College for baseball. And Austin Petticourt to Warner University for baseball. Congratulations. That's all for today. See you next time on Keeping Up With The Cats. Too sweet for me.